Mistake number one that older guys make trying to look young is just that. They're trying to look young instead of embracing their age. Here's the deal, is that you don't want to look young. What you want to look is healthy. You want to look strong. You want to look successful. So there was a 2018 study published in the Journal of Science Advances, and they actually studied online dating ideal ages. For men, what do you think the ideal age was? 20, 30, 40? No, it was 50 years old. So my point is, it's not about you looking young, it's about you looking good for your age, you looking the best that you can with what you got. In today's video, gents, 10 mistakes older guys make trying to look young. And make sure to stick around to the end of this video because I'm going to talk about that study again where they talk about peak attractiveness age for women. Guys, it was brutal. So the next mistake older guys make trying to look young is they can't let go of their baseball caps. Guys, look to upgrade your headwear. If you're going to support your favorite team, of course, wear your team colors. But guys, look for situations where you can upgrade your headwear. If it's hot outside, the sun is going to be in your face, then look for a hat, maybe a Panama, something with a wide brim. If it's in the winter months, then all of a sudden bring in maybe an insulated flat cap that's going to have, you know, this one right here turns out and covers the ears. Look for something that functions. Look to upgrade your headwear game. Now, I know a lot of you guys are wearing that baseball cap because you don't want to deal with your hair. That takes me to the next point, which is to level up your hair game by going to the best stylist in your area. Maybe you've been going to the same barber for years. Maybe you haven't been to a barber for years. In any case, guys, take some pride in your hair. Have fun. Go get a new style. You've got longer hair. Try a shorter hairstyle. If you're losing hair, if you've got thinning hair here, consider shaving it off, going for a different, more dominant look. Don't want to go with the bald look? Then look at your options. Maybe you want to find a treatment that's going to help it grow back. Maybe you want to look at a hair transplant. The point is take control of your hair. So the next mistake older guys make trying to look young, they try to keep up with those 20 year olds. They're going out drinking all night, partying all night. And guess what? Guys, time is going to catch up with you. Your body needs more rest. You've got to take care of your body. Guys, if you want to look healthy, if you want to have great looking skin, focus in on your diet, focus in on exercise and bring in Tiege Hanley. So Tiege Hanley, the sponsor of today's video, guys, they make skincare uncomplicated. How? Every single month, they send you a package of exactly what you need, plus this card right here that breaks out exactly what your morning and evening skincare routine should be. So if you're over the age of 30, you're starting to get wrinkles, you're starting to get bags under the eyes, guys, you should be looking at Tiege Hanley Level 3. Now here's the breakout of the Tiege Hanley Level 3 morning routine. First, you're going to wet your face with warm water. Next, you're going to gently rub the wash onto your face. Then you're going to rinse your face. Then twice per week, you're going to gently massage the scrub onto your face in a circular motion. Then you're going to rinse your face and pat dry with a towel. Next, you're going to apply the super serum evenly on your entire face. Now the super serum is power packed with antioxidants, vitamins, and anti-aging ingredients. Next, you're going to apply the eye cream evenly around your eyes. Now the eye cream, it's formulated to fight the appearance of crow's feet, dark circles, and puffiness. Every single month, you get the system delivered right to your door, free shipping in the US, you can cancel at any time. Gentlemen, I use the skincare level three system. My son uses the acne system. I know the guys personally. I've watched them go from idea to concept to now a thriving company, helping thousands and thousands of men with their skincare. Gentlemen, use the link down in the description of today's video to get the best deal you're going to find out there on the web for Tiege Hanley. So the next mistake older guys make trying to look young is they wear their running shoes everywhere. Guys, invest in some good casual footwear. So you can go with a simple white sneaker. Notice the difference here. This is a huge upgrade. Okay, you don't want to deal with this getting dirty. Then go with a simple black. Maybe bring in something a little bit more stylish. Notice how the silhouette all of a sudden changed on this. We've got a perforated leather. In any case, Tons of options out there for casual shoes. Just don't be wearing those running shoes, guys. They're for running. And if you're going to be running, sure, wear them. But for other situations, look to upgrade your shoes. So the next mistake older guys make, wearing the wrong type of jeans. So when you're in your 20s, you're in great shape. You can get away with a lot of things. You can wear things that honestly don't look that great, but because you've got a killer body, you're going to be fine. But as you age, your body oftentimes, well, it's just not like it was in its 20s. So you need to make sure that you're wearing jeans that work for your body type. 
Now, for most older guys, this is going to mean no skinny jeans and definitely no baggy jeans. Now, when it comes to rhinestones on those back pockets, I'm going to say probably avoid that when it comes down to baggy jeans that are sagging down past your buttocks. Please do not do that when it comes to distressed jeans. I think some guys can pull it off if they know what they're doing, but that's more for the fashion forward. So I'm going to have a little bit of fun with this next mistake. When I was 19, I wore this graphic tee. It said, men make the strangest requests. To this day, a buddy of mine, his wife, still remembers me wearing this and she did not have a favorable impression of me for a decade. The point is, if you're an older guy trying to look young, wearing these graphic tees with funny sayings, the issue here is what is your real goal and message in life? Are you trying to achieve greatness? Are you trying to get that company off the ground? Are you trying to go out there and be the best man you can be to be a great father to set an example? Here's the issue. When you wear something like that, you are not sending the message you want to send. And guys, graphic tees in general have been overplayed. They don't work for most body types. You would look so much better with a nice casual button down. And speaking of shirts, no one to tuck them in. When you're young, you can kind of get away with it. But again, when you get older, there's expectations that you understand when a shirt should be tucked in and when it should be worn untucked. Dress shirts are always tucked in. When it comes down to other casual button outs, I know that a lot of times you've worn that untucked, but look to see how would it look if you tucked in that casual button down. Now with polos, those are oftentimes going to have a straight bottom, but you want to make sure you buy a shirt that's made to be worn untucked that isn't too long or too short. The easiest way to figure this out, I've got you covered right here. I've got lengths of what should be tucked, what should be untucked. Now getting back to that first mistake, your goal isn't to look young. Your goal is to look healthy. Your goal is to look successful. But what does it mean to look successful? Now, when you go back and you look at the research from that 2018 study on online dating, what you'll notice is that men, we focus in on one thing, age. Women, they focus in on multiple variables. So, men, we focus in on getting a partner that's younger than us. The optimum age, in case you're wondering, 18. Yes, I know, brutal, but that's what the research clearly showed. Women, on the other hand, they're looking at a number of other cues. They're smarter. They realize, okay, if I want a mate that's actually going to work for me and what I'm looking for, I need to look at the whole picture. So, looking at all this, the biggest mistake that older guys make is they're still thinking like they did in their youth. They're focusing on one thing instead of saying, you know what? It's a bigger puzzle. It's multiple things and I should not only focus in on my health, on my appearance, but also on the way I present myself and the full picture. So, what video to watch next? Well, guys, we didn't talk about body language mistakes, but I do in this video. So, go check it out and make sure that you don't make any of these mistakes.